Syracuse University has invited acclaimed Palestinian poet Mosab Abu Toha to be part of its Scholars at Risk network. Citrus TV's Cora Mayer Costa is here with updates to the program. Cora, is this the second person invited? Yes, Zach. Abu Toha will be the second person a part of this program. The first is a Ukrainian scholar who had to flee her country. I spoke to her on how the program works to protect scholars from these attacks. In the past year, over 400 scholars have been attacked worldwide. Of those scholars, Palestinian poet Mosab Abu Toa has been offered an SAR position at SU. Professor Tula Goenka met Abu Toa during his MFA at Newhouse and says Abu Toa can bring a lot to the role. And uh, shed light on darkness and also share it with the world. Um, and I think uh, that's what Musab is so successful in doing. Like if you read his poems um, in this book, Things You May Find Hidden in My Year, he talks about what you should do if your house is being bombed. <laughs> what are the five things you should uh, try and save? The first scholar admitted to SU's program is Tetiana Hrenshak, who is a leading researcher in Kyiv, Ukraine. But I'm still a scientist and scholar, and I can communicate with students, teach students. So I keep my scholarly identity thanks to this program. Goenka hopes the SAR program is the beginning of SU's acknowledgement of current global conflicts. But it's, it's a larger issue, um, and, uh, and I hope uh, that the administration can uh, show more compassion. And I just hope that we can um, really talk about the humanity and the extent of the genocide. With the intermittent blackouts across Gaza, Abu Toa is unable to respond to SU's invitation into the program. Citrus TV will be following this developing story, but for now, I'm Corey Maricosta. Guys, 